All days are numbered, not just the ones in 2021. That's that's a fair point. Hello, YouTube. What are you doing? Welcome to the stream, YouTube. We're just getting rocking and rolling here. We appreciate you dropping in, stopping by. We've got some cool sunglasses for you down in the chat and a couple of people that, that want to say hi, YouTube. Z's forehead's Avengers level threat. I appreciate that. Blahars! Here's where we are, by the way. We're two matches into the season. We got a team that we love. We want to wait Admiral Vekermudling, and we won at home against Lask. Two winning group teams from last season. We beat them both. We are simply just that good. Oh, give me that wide target man vibe. Oh my god. Ah! Wide target man for days. You know, what's interesting is I think he's going to act like if we do a comparison, I think he's going to be better than Joe Oliveira. Like significantly. I understand the fact that you want to secure your future. Through us not getting relegated. All right. Hinterseer is down for a super cheap contract. The more I think about it, I don't think you can. Well, I, th this is unfortunate. A bunch of second division teams. But you know what? We're a top flight team, which means we have to trust the pull that we're going to have on Asensio. Boom! I'm get, we're going to say that a lot, aren't we? We're going to say we're going to say that a lot. But oh! Raul! Right, we've got the Raul Asensio helping out our front line. Welcome to the club, Raul. All right, Graham, I want you to move, Jordan. That is the deal. Uh, Jordan, I'm going to offer you out for 150000 We're not really in it for the money. We're in it for the spot on the roster we're just swapping you out for a better player can you say that to somebody's face be like look man we are swapping you out there is a better player really looking forward to uh to that better player being here instead of you really looking forward to it is that just mean i feel like that's just mean you can't just say that to a human being be like yeah no we've got we've got a better player coming in you gotta give a number to Raul. Give me 11. I feel like Raul Asensio is gonna rock the bejesus at a number 11. Anthony Schmid into the team. We the just started Graham. The worst part of a synchronized Christmas. swimming team is when someone drowns. All right, first match to stream us and Wolfsberger. Let's get it. Is there franchise models and drafts, you know, so the teams are more level? But even in college football, where you have really bad teams play against really good teams. Yikes, that almost went in. Pass it. Oh, short. Honestly, never mind. That This might work. Anderson. Vainema, goodness me, where's the burst? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Anderson! That's better, though. That's better. Oh, here we go. Starting on a corner. Akush Kaskesh, no! The Hungarian! Ah! Oh, Venema. Good, it's still ours. Just stop, turn. Weird layoff. Working in tight spaces here, but it's working. Custodio, Anderson, good. Don't lunge. That was nice. I was an hour and a half late, but boy, did he get the tackle right. Oh, no. Ref. No way. Ref. Ref. That was money in the bank every day of the week and twice on Sunday, ref. What? God, Lay got that right. That is a harsh penalty. Come on, Blackman. Blackman! Oh. All right, it's fine. It's fine. We bounce back from that. We bounce back from that. We play our game. Uh, we're going to get Anthony Schmidt farther up the field. We're going to go inside forward. We're going to go uh, 
You know, Elias Anderson and Custodio, a little more level. And we're going to reduce our width a little bit. And we're going to raise our lines one. Just got to keep that energy. Schmidt not doing well. Raul Asensio, this is an excellent opportunity for you to make quite the debut. And we are going to swap out Oliveira because he has been really bitterly disappointing. Oh, that's, that's definitely been a contributing factor to this. Is that we stayed after the substitution of Imakogu, we stayed playing the long ball to him. Which is not helping because when we're just conceding possession. Thank you, Blackman. I also help out coaching with the U11's girl team in real life, so it's such a fun save to play. Raul Asensio! Imbakogu, it's a great ball. Vidic, he's just faster than, in, you know, the, the lads. Nobody's there for Raul. He has all the time in the world to wait for that ball. He figures out the right finish under the pressure. We are the better team. Ain't over yet, Vidic. Oh, nice moves. Oh my God, it's Raul! Oh my word, it's Raul at the death with the last kick of the game. It's utter brilliance from Vinic. And the 18-year-old has willed Florence Dorfer from behind to in front. What a service by Vinic. Raul Asensio hardly speaks the same language as anyone in the team, but he's on the same page. Come on, baby! Oh, three matches, three wins. How do you like those apples, huh? How do you like those apples? Uh, we work hard for that. We got the reward. You know, we worked hard. We found the goal. We found the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. It was a battle. Yeah, I feel like the refs definitely hurt us. And talk about, dude, a two goal debut in the 90th and 95th minute to go from losing to winning. That That is a dream. Six foot six, isn't that really, really tall? It's two meters tall if you want the conversion. Joseph Croston has gotten himself a work permit to come play in Austria, the 18-year-old American goalkeeper. America's finest export. Goalkeepers, welcome into the team, Joseph Croston. Another player! <laughs> 20 gifted subs for another player today. Holy smokes, Rumstick, Lewis. We got this. What's our payroll budget? It's like how much we're spending compared to other teams. We go to team detailed, we should be able to see that. So our salary per year, we're paying 3.5 million. Salzburg's paying 34.6 million. They might be paying one player more than my entire budget. That'd be an interesting thing to look at actually. Team selection for Salzburg. Are you paying a player more than I'm paying my entire team? Yes, multiple. Costa, Semikas, and Suso are getting paid more than my entire team. Musa Dembele and Adnan Yanezai are getting paid roughly equivalent to my entire team. I love it. I did pay attention to Vine. Yes. Lucas Hinterseer is in the team. Uh, we're comfortable with a draw today. Not that we want one, but we're comfortable with it. We want to try and shrink the match. And Javi Vasquez is about to have to just pull out a, a tremendous performance. I'm going to give Hinterseer the 18. Come on, baby. Yeah, we are. Look at the fuck plots. Look at this beautiful stadium. Woo! Yeah! Woo! Great stadium. This is a, um, this is what you call a cathedral of the game. Collins, thank you for the Twitch Prime. Harley Boyd, thank you for the Prime. Welcome to the Hammers, both of you. We are going to get very high up the field, though. 
Away. Yeah! Ortiz! And a baby. Way to push out. We just can't, we can't get beat on those wing runs. If we give them a shot inside there, that's okay. We're gonna need them to miss a few that look like that. It's the distribution, man. It's the freaking distribution. You can't win the ball distributing it up the field like that. We got to go to the fullbacks. Ha! Giving away possession too easily on our distribution. That's fine. Should have gone quickly, though. He should have known, like, they're just going to... Oh... I haven't even seen us on the ball in a highlight yet. I mean, seriously. They show up and they're at the top of their game. Not too much we can do. I'm taking Oliveira off at halftime. I haven't seen the guy win. The one header he won went to nobody in our shirts. What a save. Yeah, Oliveira's in 6.2. My eyes aren't lying to me. Uh, give me Hinter Seer and give me Jerry and Bakogu. Literally double change the top of the formation to go into the second half. I'm not going to make all three changes, but that's that's what I want right now. Big work ball off in the box. I think it's pretty clear an hour in that we're not even going to get a spell of this match where we look like a competent team. Doing just enough to stay alive in this match to steal a point at the end here. Schmidt. Yeah, wasn't a terrible ball. All right, Anderson. Stodio. Schmidt. Schmidt, you know. At least it's a shot. This might be the spell where we finally get something going. And Bakogu, lovely out for Anthony Schmidt. Schmidt. Custodio! <laughs> Custodio lights up the fuck plots with the equalizing goal for Florence North for AC. Great work from Jerry. Those fresh ideas up top. Schmidt gives him a chance. I mean, what a, what a shot. What a shot. We get our half chance to put the ball in the net. Custodio takes advantage. The captain inspiring Florence Dorfer. Oh no, Custodio, that's a terrible giveaway, dude. Javi's not exactly lighting the uh, the track on fire. And yet, we didn't, did we? Uh-oh. I've been a lot of less than ideal situations in my life. This, this classifies as really high on the list. Ah, what a block by the bum burglar. David Bumberger launching himself in for the block. All right, Blackman. Let's go! Jamal, the block man. Blow the whistle. Riley, they give the 10 gifted. Oh, they've done it. Unbelievable. They've stolen a point against Red Bull Salzburg. Absolutely remarkable. 3xG to 0.13, but Captain Olivier Custodio scores the goal.
And despite Ian Ortiz's ejection with 20 minutes to play, Floridsdorfer have the point. We're made of sterner stuff. We are made. You know, we just kept pace at the top of the table with Salzburg. Ain't nothing to it, really. Ain't nothing to it. Just kept pace with Salzburg, top of the table, and uh, looking forward, uh, looking forward to the future. You know, I am. Here's us being able to figure that out. Caleb Spear, I'm gonna give a start to Caleb Spear instead of David Bumberger. Yeah, we're struggling for a little match. Sharpness will be fine. Caleb Spear into the team. Prisikene's in because Ian Ortiz is, well, suspended. Let's go look to get back in the win column. Corgan, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime, my dude. Welcome to the Hammers. I think I get afford Lei in the third tier of Denmark. As long as you can give him a contract, you can afford him. He doesn't cost any money. You just give Rafael Lei a contract from Henderson Eels, and it has to be over the threshold to get any work permit, and then he's in. That's it. Oh, we have a Clive Redemption. Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Lafnitz for this Austrian Bundesliga match between Floridsdorfer. Three wins and a draw in their first four, including the improbable draw against RB Salzburg. A collection of youngsters in their second season in the top flight. And is trying to really surprise Veinema! Oh! Early electricity from Floridsdorfer. Anderson. It's on for Vidic. Vidic. Attacking with pace. Vidic! Oh, what a fabulous bit of dribbling from the young Canadian. And it looks like he's won a penalty. Schneg grasping at straws as Vidic flies by him. The 32-year-old in his second appearance for Floridsdorfer that will step to the ball. Hintersia scores the goal! Floridsdorfer leads! And a deserving lead for Floridsdorfer, who have controlled the early proceedings here at Lafnitz. Hintersia, Asensio, is he onside? He was not. The flag is up on the far side. But there's precious little possession for Lafnitz in this match right now. They've not been able to get themselves in hold of the ball. Vasquez to Vainema. Lucas Hintersia off the bar. And it's spun away for what will be a goal kick. Oh. Lucas Intesia hunting a second goal that would have been spectacular, but it will get a second opportunity. This is a penalty. Ref. It's ref, a handball. Ref. It has to be. Ref. Ref. Smith throwing his limbs up like one of those guys in front of a car dealership. And he's given Lucas Hintesia a second penalty of the evening. Hintesia. Same side. Same result. And it's 2-0. Custodio, Asensio, Hintersia. And where is this going? Nick Veinema! He was offside. He missed for good measure. God's power tower. It's got the ball back. Igor Vidic in the channel, and it's saved by Narfluck. And that might have been the last meaningful push from Lafnitz. Veinema. Nolan, oh, what a ball, and it's God's power tower in behind, and a goal from God himself. It's God's power tower with the icing on the cake, the light at the end of the tunnel from the heavens. The Nigerian, as tidy as you like. And Floridsdorfer are looking really indomitable. Another three points for the Dorfers. Chocolate milk, thank you for the prime. And that is the Clive redemption. You love being able to do one of the, you do, doing a nice broadcast for one of the games. The players always believe in themselves, absolutely. Uh, we're just building on good times. You know, the team's happy. Players are happy. We're, we're executing our game plan. When we go out there, we play against these opponents like Lafnitz. We're doing what we need to do. Putting pressure on their back line consistently. Getting bodies in the box. Saw plenty of good things. Yeah, got to just remain focused. Got to remain focused. 
cool 275,000 Jordan Graham you're a great servant to the club yeah I helped you improve your game I helped you get back on your feet really happy to hear that man thanks for freeing up the wage Avi Bueno rejects contract Ronaldo Tavares has done a move loan deal for Draga Marchetta great way to continue your development even getting the playing time we would have wanted and not something I thought I would have control over uh, we have signed Daniel Beer. Breakthrough Prospect joins us immediately from Australia, our latest acquisition. And you know what? That wasn't a bad get. He's not immediately ready for the first team, but he is certainly not a bad get. What's he got? He was a good tackler. Yeah, a little slow. Work on that. Wow! So we made the call of a lifetime. And it actually ended up working. That might have been one of the smartest things we've done in a long time. We looked at Rocky Bashiri, and we had a contract agreed for 396000 He decided to join us instead of Motherwell. And we rejected that contract because we didn't know everything about him. Because we realized he wasn't going to get a work permit. And the only teams offering him were from the United Kingdom. We trialed him for a month, learned everything about him. Realized his true value, got a contract over 100000 a year lower, and we are still able to bring him in to be a right-back, center-back combo player for us. Absolutely monstrous. I don't want to work on his touch. His touch is fine. Crossing is definitely disappointed. But physically and intelligence-wise, he's the guy need the reliable veteran presence we've got the explosive youngsters we need the reliable veteran presence and that's freddy salazar somebody that you know is basically the opposite he's just very consistent i'm gonna teach him how to play complete wing back he's already got some affinity for it and he would be a sick complete wing back if we wanted to put him behind like vidic or lay at some point that would be fun i'm just gonna double intensity that intensive language course All right, we started Spear for the last match, but Bumberger back in today. New numbers for Salazar and Bashiri. We have Salazar 10, Bashiri gets 5. Anderson being suspended hurts, but we're at the Fock plots, so... It's where we were born to be playing. It's where kids grow up in Colombia, like Salazar, dreaming of playing at the Fock plots. Now, we gave Spear a game in the last match, and that ended up being a good call, but I want to acclimate our new guys. I want to acclimate Salazar and Bashiri, which means the rest of our team needs to be full strength. And save. That looked uncomfortable for Blackman. So I'm happy he got his feet right. I'm happy he was able to make the save. Look at Rocky. Actually knows what to do over there. Ortiz was learning. Ooh, God's power on for Schmidt. I think. I say I think. I, I have no idea. To move our lines up we need to play in their half of the field more not asserting ourselves enough when we have the ball because we have a lot of the ball we're not doing much with it Venema, here we go all right salazar hinters here is he on that's an issue Goodness me, guys. Was that Rocky that kept him on? Sensio. Custodio. Oh, hang on to it. Draw the defender a little more. Oh, Salazar. We do have quality and decent goal scoring ability in a lot of different spots in the field. 
Would love to take advantage of, but that works. That's fine. All right, let's go get another one. We've been much more positive in the second half. The team just needed a good yelling at. Hendrasir wins the battle. Fighting with Rocky Bashiri. Instead of curling up into a ball, I knew he had the quality to go take more of the game to them, and we've taken more of the game to them. Custodio. Oh, my goodness. It's Ezio! I think he was on. Yes! <laughs> Give me Vintage. Give me Vintage for Freddy. Custodio again with the sauce. Good run by Asensio. Saucy little finish. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, he's on. Stride for stride with that guy. Raul Asensio. All right, Javi. Not in the easiest spot here. One normal day, it's all I'm asking for, is one normal day, you know? One day that's normal, that's not freaking crazy, you know? Oh God, the sauce from Jamal, Caleb Spear even, holding his composure. This is incredible. Wow, look at us go. I didn't even know we could do that. Oof. You've done brilliantly to come back and win that. Again, showing tremendous heart, despite a terrible performance from some of the starters out there. Carried by God's power. Absolutely. As it's not the first time we've grabbed victory from the jaws of defeat, but I'll tell you what, we're giving Salzburg something to think about. And that's really, you know, Austria-Vienne's a darn good team. We're giving Salzburg something to think about, though.